history of hosting, but in a different format. Like I've always hosted open mics. That's usually been my thing. So, you know, a bunch of people coming in, sharing the stage for a, for a hot minute, and then, and then leaving. And I like that because as an artist growing up, not growing up, but like growing up into artistry or in, in getting more confident as a singer, open mics were like the most important thing to, to be able to just train yourself to be comfortable to get up in front of a crowd of people you don't know and get used to that I think is a really good thing to practice in so. There's another sing-along part. If you've got your, you're feeling a little warm now, you've got your vocals warmed up, your part goes like this. Photographs in the hands of the agents. Can you try that? Photographs in the hands of the agents with a short and sword. So not all the artists are uh, performing musicians, but I think, no, I, 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 I think we all are actually performing musicians in some right, in some capacity. And um, you just get to choose anyone you want to put together. And um, Cassidy, I met Cassidy years ago. Actually, we both, when they train um, medical students, they need actors to, to play out certain scenarios in different, and, and it's called standardized patient work. And both Cassie and I worked as standardized patients in the past. And that's how we met, through the act, through some acting friends, actually. And then it turns out she was a musician as well, and, and we just kind of kept in touch over the years. But we'd never played a show together until tonight. So things started to pick up, and I was trying to, like, scratch the Rolodex a little of musicians that I know and, um, and I thought it would just be a good time to see what she was up to. When I moved to Vancouver I didn't know anyone um, so I just started going to open mics with my auto harp and I, I could barely play it um, and I didn't have any songs written so I was just playing covers uh, at open mics and then I just kind of fell in love with the music scene in Vancouver and met so many cool people. Um, Loved the community and yeah, started writing music and loved it. This one's called Liar's Waltz. You have no idea what I think about.
about realizing you're a people pleaser and doing something about it. Right, this is called prison. <laughs> 